Hi, it's Chris here from the EQ Mod Group. In this tutorial, I'd like to look at EQ Tour. This is a, a very lightweight application um, that allows you to navigate the mount to a list of uh, objects of interest. I'll start it up and show you how, what it looks like. Now, the first thing to say about this application is it's an ASCOM client, which means it talks to ASCOM drivers uh, it doesn't have to be EQ ASCOM that this is controlling. Uh, it should work with other ASCOM telescope drivers, should you have other, other mounts. The first thing we have to do, therefore, is to tell it which uh, driver to connect to. And this is through the, the usual ASCOM chooser interface. You select the mount of your choice. And once you've done that, you can select this option here, which means whenever this application starts in future, it will automatically connect to the thing you've chosen. Okay, I now need to, because I didn't have that checked, I now need to connect. And I'm now connected to the driver. Um, I've already got it running, so uh, that's why you didn't see it pop up. Now, the way this works is, is very simple. Here, in this drop-down, is a list of pre-prepared uh, tours of objects. So, if we pick something like the um, Messier, if we want to go off to the uh, M13, we simply double-click it. And as you can see, Off we go to M13. There we are, a bit of confirmation. Uh, want to see the Whirlpool Galaxy? We just double click. And there we are. Now there's an altitude filter, so I can say, well, you know, I'd really like to just look at things that are above my head. And if I do that, as you can see, it gets filtered down. We can even look below the horizon if we want, if we're up on a mountain. Um, but that's a useful little feature, it, it, particularly if, if you're um, showing off to friends or whatever, you want to show them the sights of an evening. Uh, you can pick things that are nice and high up, they're going to get the best views, and get a list of, 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 of whatever you want. Um, doubles, obviously, are always quite impressive. And with the doubles, this list also includes um, information on the color difference. So you can pick out ones that are particularly, uh, have particular contrast. Let's just zoom in and have a look at those two. Yeah, there we go. You'll notice that uh, Tour has a sync button. Um, it can issue an ASCOM sync, and so it could be used with uh, EQ ASCOM to provide alignment if you use a list of stars, and we do actually provide a list of alignment stars. Some people prefer to work from uh, text lists rather than planetarium. It's, it's just a matter of choice. Okay, uh, there is a facility in here to actually create your own tours, and Essentially, these things are just uh, text files, so they're very easy to do. I'll probably cover that in a separate tutorial. Um, the only other thing that's probably worth mentioning at the moment is there's also an option to warn if you're going to cross the meridian. Uh, people sometimes like to know that that's going to happen, and perhaps if they are just uh, giving a tour to, to a group of friends, they'd, they'd rather not worry about uh, cables and things uh, snagging. So with that option checked, you can just make sure that you're going to uh, visit things that, that, that aren't going to require a, a, a flip. Okay, that'll do for the moment, I think. Um, oh, no, 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 there's one other thing I ought to um, explain. EQ ASCOM can launch Tor directly. And the way it does this is initially when you install EQ ASCOM, it doesn't know where that tour ex executable is, so you have to tell it. Um, so you browse through your hard drive until you find it. 
Once you've done that, when you click on the Tor button, it will automatically start Tor, which will then automatically connect back to EQASCOM. And so it appears like an integrated part of EQASCOM. It isn't. It's a separate application, but that's just a sort of a cunning uh, plan we had to make it look as though it's integrated. Okay, that'll do for this tutorial.